they've done this very graphic, strong, thick, kind of 80s eyebrow with a very graphic chocolate lip. It looks like tribal sculpture or something a little. Totally. I kind of love it because it is very sculptural, yet at the same time it's come from something that's very sporty. The inspiration for Donna Karen's new collection is Haiti, and she's definitely bringing the steam heat today. It's really about the sensuality and the sexiness, and the people of Haiti, every single person is an artisan, everyone. And I've been very involved in Bali, and I do a lot of my work in Bali. And I said, I really believe the Bali model is the Haitian model. What did you see that was strongest? We certainly saw a lot of body conscious, a lot of the sort of drapey outer layers that you see atop the form-fitted Donna dresses. And, you know, she was pushing the fabric, pushing the pattern, but staying more conservative to her heritage with the shape. I like the graphism because she's been very, almost like Hollywood glamour for a few seasons. I thought it was quite refreshing to see something that was so in your face. Yeah, it was quite graphic, but they're quite kind of toned down dark colours, so it, it was almost like a subtle graphic, which I think worked in contrast with the really womanly, flowing, wide skirts and sexy kind of bodice tops. What I hope to do is get everybody involved, all the designers, to see what the opportunity in Haiti is. It's amazing. There's not an artist who wouldn't want to work there.